Hi everybody, welcome back to No Games for Old Men. I'm Dan, and we're back here in Assassin's Creed Chronicles China. This is the second level, and from here on out, everything is brand new to me. I had only ever played that first level before, so this is this is now a blind playthrough. They have also, uh, my apartment is near an airport. Lovely. And uh, this morning they have decided that the arriving planes are going to be flying directly over my apartment, so... Awesome. If you hear a rumbling, that's what that is. I keep... <laughs> I was just playing... What game was I playing recently? Where you hold A to sprint, and so that's why I keep jumping when I mean to be... mean to be sprinting. Time to become more familiar with my surroundings. That's a pretty, uh, that's a pretty image right there. Very, very artistic. I like it. I feel like my microphone is way too far away from my face. What is this? Whoa. Oh, neat. Oh gosh, you get like a whole... You can see the whole level. Oh man. And is that... I'm guessing that's a hidden animus shard. Gee whiz. RB to zoom in. I want to zoom out. What happened? I broke it. I broke the game, guys. Three assassin scrolls. Found something? Uh oh. Something no. You? No. Nothing. No. Nothing. You guys gonna come up that wall? Can you do a double assassination from from up high? Hmm. Okay, but remember uh, from last time, they uh, and when they're talking, they don't see what's happening around them, which is just bizarre. <laughs> but hey, I'll take it. Jump! Oh. Oh. Alright, let's see. Do you come far enough for me to be able to, to get you? Yep. Oh! Oh dear. Uh, but there's nowhere to dump his body. Can I... Like, dump it here? Down that little... It looks like there's a sheen. There it goes. From right to left, across this green pit here. There it goes again. That makes it, like, video game language. When something has a sheen like that, it means it's interactive. So I don't know if... I probably just I'm doing that thing again where I get hung up on a a detail. Oh boy. Sneaky sneaky. Oh, okay, so it is interactable, I just wasn't doing it right. Oh, here we go. And gold. Um, let's see. Do I want to whistle? Maybe. Is 
怎么回事？ Will he come over here? Yeah, yeah. Get you. Had to be done. Guards can call reinforcements to help in a fight. Reinforcements are hidden behind closed doors. Rot roll. Uh, let's see. I can't go to the left, or can I? Nope. Hmm. Dash between different hiding places. What? Oh, that's cool. Uh... Oh no! <gasps> no, you don't see anything. No, 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 no. You don't see anything. Oh man, I just lost this. my first gold. Poo. They who? There wasn't anybody there. You didn't see anything. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, so as soon as he turns around, I gotta get up and moving. Oh. God, that was close. Yow. Okay, I can either go up. Um, is this a little cave? No. Okay, uh, I can either go up or I can go to the right. Let's see if there's anything interesting to the right. Oh, an animus shard. I didn't even see that. Huzzah. I'm thinking that's not anything. I, don't, I can't make that jump, so... Throwing knives to cut ropes. Also drop it on their head. Hmm. Maybe not. Oh no! That is not at all what I meant to do. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. All right. Let's try this again. Oh, 
Okay, now just just drop down. Drop. There we go. Oh, there's an animus shard here. Run. Get in there. Okay, now what? Guys, the ocean. Oh, there's a. Guys, the ocean. There's a pit there. A green pit. Oh man. They're, you guys are just gonna stand there now? Oh, dude. Let's see, can I whistle just loud enough for him to... He's gonna totally see that though. Yep. I don't remember how to fight. I thought it was left thumbstick and A to block. Hmm. So maybe while they're distracted. Oh, okay. So while they're just distracted like that, you can... Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, child. Okay. Wow. That was a terrible performance. <laughs> and jump! Get ourselves another throwing knife. Oh, I see a shiny. Hmm. Okay, so I'm behind a solid wall. All right. Hmm. You can use knives while climbing walls. Oh, there's the string. I see it. Derp. Now what? least three guards down here. Oh. Okay, here is where we're going to drop on these guys. Well, I don't know, because then that'll alert him, right? Nice. Oh, wow. Huh. <laughs> Oh, 
wasn't sure it was going to work that way. Okay, was that was that the zone? Did I miss anything? Ooh. Alright, we got a crossbow boss guarding something very valuable. Let's test your reflexes. <laughs> First fail. Second fail. My god. Perhaps the heat of battery and sharpen your wits. The lesson ends here. What? Wow, I really suck at the combat. Handle it that way. What did we get? Is this just a thing to hide the body in? It's not even that. What's happening? happening. see slats here. Does that mean there's something down here? Yeah, I'm thinking not. That's quite a drop. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> I almost missed that. I wonder if there's a place, like, in the options menu where you can enter a training room or something to practice your combat, because I'm awful at it. I keep forgetting the commands. Oh boy. Use the noise dart to lure the guard away from the hay bale. Classic Assassin's Creed hay bale, making a triumphant return after being absent for a few games. Now I get you. Oh, god damn. Snap the neck. Oh. 
kind of a grotesque sound. I get sick to my stomach when when people like crack their neck or their knuckles. All right, moving in bus bushes, the white character outline will vanish. This indicates this indicates you can be seen by enemies. Oh. Remain stationary in bushes when enemies approach to avoid being detected. Can I assassinate from the bush and bring his body in? Yep. Cool, okay. Man, they they are introducing a lot of a lot of things here. I'm kind of kind of nervous about later levels where I'm going to have to string all of these things together. Ooh. Oh god. That was close. Okay. Up we go. Nice. Level seems quite a this bit. This is where we used to keep the assassin scrolls. I should try to retrieve as many as I can while I have the chance. Yeah. Okay, so I've got this foreground area with a slat wall going up the right side, or I can go across this balance beam. Um. Yeah, I don't know which one leads to the scrolls. I guess we'll find out. There you go. Quit your jabber John and get over here. Oh, I could have I could have gotten into that pit. Chickened out. Okay. Is there anything down here to collect? No. What happens if you assassinate from here? Do you pull him into the pit? No, you do not. Okay, so we're gonna have to hide this body. Can you hide more than one body in a thing? Apparently. Uh, noise darts? How many of these can you carry? Is it two of each item? Yeah. Alright, we've got... Oh! There's some scrolls. Oh, okay. That's what I gotta do. Come down here. And then run and leap! Oh, that was the opposite of what I wanted to do. I run and leap! Ooh. Wow. Okay, we got one. Yikes. That was nerve-wracking. Alright, we've got a shard up there. Just making sure there's nothing hidden behind the rocks here. Oh, a 
dog. Hmm. It's another animus shard too. All right, so he actually looks back for quite a while. I don't think it's long enough for me to run up and assassinate him, but I could get in here. And then maybe, oh, if I whistle, the dog will freak out. So I don't think I want to do that. And I don't see anybody over there. Maybe I do have time to run up and get him. Let's try it. Oh my god, that is not... I did it again. Pick up the body. Rats. No! Pick up the body. Throw the body in there. Okay. Good grief. Alright, I did that thing where I press A to, to sprint again. And <laughs> Alright, what do I do with the dog? Is it do I just let him bark? I guess. Alright, you, sir. After your compadre here disappears. Oh, they look down in the... Hmm... Do I want to get him first? Can I? Can I j jump down there from here? I have to take the ladder, okay. Shoot. back, we'll pull him in. Hopefully he wasn't see the body first. Oh, crap. Ooh, wow. He was almost about to see the body. Yikes. Hey, man. Can we get you out, or... I guess not. Alright, so that was one scroll that I found so far. It's uh, surprisingly elaborate. What's going on here? could like pull them oh wow huh? why is this not working oh crap here we go again Okay, it's X is standard, Y is super. Um, did I get the scroll down there? <laughs> yes, I did. I was so I was so uh, wigged out by what was going on that I didn't even know if I picked up the scroll I was supposed to pick up. Okay, so this is just the other... Got it. Ok, 
kind of impressed by the level design here. It's it's interesting. Oh, it's 2D, but 3D. 2.5D, I think they call it. I know they call it. Oh, no. Oof. Oh, an Animus shard here. Wow! Didn't even tuck and roll. Just just took that on the ankles. Oh, sweet. Got them all. Outstanding. Okay, so that is... That is the last... Objective, so now all I've got to do is get out of here. Brawler. Oh my god. Bronze. What? Walk past bird cages to avoid disturbing them and alerting nearby enemies. Okay. Hello, birdie. We're walking. Oh, what? How am I going to get that? Okay, nothing there. Alright, how do I get that shard without... Oh. Who? Interesting. I can assassinate from here. Right, let's try it. Oh, wow, he got me. Ooh, good. Oh, nope. Nope. What's the block? Shall we? Oh. <laughs> they just shoot the dude and leave his corpse laying there. Uh, such disrespect. Okay, so I thought it was like pressing the direction. The direction of the attack and press B to block. Yeah, it's gotta be because A is jump. Well, maybe I just didn't execute it properly. So that guy got me right away. I wonder if I get the other guy first. Okay. Not great. But it got us through. What the heck? Wow. I 
if I got all the animus shards. So I can... There's plants there. Oh, jeez. Really? Let's go this way, then. <laughs> if he's gonna be looking down into pits. Uh. Oh, there's another anim shard there. Definitely get up here and get that. Jump. Jump. <gasps> oh, wow. It's a good thing he's down there and not up. Is this where I want to be? I think so. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we got to go back that way. Nope. That's not what you want to do. Oh man. Hmm. Wonder if I can get up there to that one. Or if the jump will take me to this lower platform. Oh jeez. There's something up there, another chest. I don't know what's in it, though. Care of this guy, give ourselves a little breathing room. Just in time. Nothing to see here, nothing to see. Okay, do I even need to bother with this dude? Although he does look up there. So, yeah, maybe. Uh oh. Oh crap. <laughs> that was ill ill conceived and even more poorly executed. <laughs> oh. Uh, okay, so obviously we want to take care of this guy too. If we're gonna take care of the other one. Okay. Although it looks like this this way to the right is my main path. It's just up here to get whatever this chest is. Okay, now I think we can get this guy somewhat safely. Except the bird. Oh man, there's a guy below him who looks up too. So I have to watch out for that. Can I drop down? No! Nope, nope. I mean, yes, but that's not at all what I wanted. Okay, we'll just come over here until they chill out. I was hoping it could, it could like, drop down and grab the next ledge, but mm. apparently that is not a, uh, a function here. Uh, 
Okay, so when they look down, they only look down where there aren't... Well, where there isn't a place for somebody to hang. So they're not real great at... Determining... Where to search. Okay, let's try this again. How far do you come? Whoop! Okay. Okay, so I want to do like a half jump. There we go. Nice. Surprise! Okay, so now- Oh, no, 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 no! What? I didn't even know that was a possibility. There aren't slats there. Hey, bird. What's the word? Alright, this guy's gonna be a problem now. Oh, maybe not. <gasps> no. Does that guy seriously block his vision? Oh, he does. Wow, that's lucky for me. They can't see past each other. Shoot. Stop doing that. Alright, what is in these? New Anim's notification. Scroll 2? What? What? What am I looking at? It's the map, obviously, but what? Sync points, anima shards, ch okay, so I've got all the, the things. Animus database? Oh, there's things. Oh, look at all this. I must have looked at these at some point. Okay. Xiao Jun was born in 1505 in the in Imperial Captivity and was raised to become a concubine in the Forbidden City. At first she was of lower rank and she was one of many girls who hoped to become a wife of the Emperor. She was taught the traditional arts displayed by the ladies of the Imperial Court, embroidery, singing, and reading. But early... reading? That's kind of a surprise because usually when you've got a oppressive... Uh, rulership, they don't want women to read. Hmm. The Chinese were uh, uh, more progressive on that front, apparently. Not in all fronts, but... But early on showed exceptional talent for dance and music. Her agility and cat-like cat -like discretion fascinated Emperor Sheng... Sheng Di? Sheng Di? I'll have to learn how to pronounce these Chinese names. As he liked abusing his power to humiliate his court, he often used the child Xiao Jun as his spy or thief to stage jokes against eunuchs or even ministers. He also forbade, forbid that Xiao Jun be footbound so that she didn't lose her dancing abilities, although footbinding was a key asset to becoming an attractive woman. While she was still a child, Xiao Jun witnessed the execution of Lu Jin, leader of the Tigers, a small group of powerful and influential eunuchs the Shengdi Emperor had found proof of Lu Jin's Lu or Liu Jin's plot to assassinate him and had the traitor tortured using the Ling Chi technique, also known as Death by a Thousand Cuts. The eunuch's agony lasted for two days, and the young Xiao Jun would never forget the punishment for betraying her emperor. Although Liu Jin had been stealing considerable amounts of gold and silver from the taxes, he was betrayed and entrapped by one of his own men, Xiang Yong, 
or Song Yang. I saw something that that said that that Z H A N G is pronounced Song, Song Yang, an agent of the Templars and his successor as the head of the Tigers. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Retrieve the Assassin Scrolls one of three? I've got all of them. What in the heck? I found all three Assassin Scrolls, scrolls did I not? Oops. So that wraps up the chapter. Huh? Is it done? Gao Feng is dead, Sifu. As is Ma Yong Chen. The butcher. Good. Our plan worked. Who's next? Patience, sister. We must move carefully. Zhang Yong and his tigers control the empire now. They said Zhang. He's down two tigers after tonight. Gao Feng did not have the box. I did not retrieve it in time. Worry not, young one. We knew that was a risk. To allow yourself to be captured without the box would have meant certain death. We will get it back. Maybe the Templars will even lead us to the missing piece. Perhaps. But now I'm afraid we have just given our enemies a dangerous weapon. Take some rest, little sister. Together, we will free our land from the Templars and their pawns. Zhang Yong and his tigers. We will rebuild our brotherhood. Ooh, two bronzes. Style bonus. Nothing. Zero. Secondary objectives. Look at this. It says zero. I totally got all three of those assassin scrolls. I don't I don't know what happened there. Hmm. Well. Maximum score available was 1520, and we didn't even get a thousand, so that was pretty pathetic. It looks like we did expand our eagle vision, though. We got that upgrade. We got that. All right, increase the distance of eagle vision, allowing Xiao Jun to see more of her surroundings. Underhang unlocked. Move left stick to move the assassin left or right. B to drop down from the platform. X or Y when an assassination is available. Hold left trigger to tuck up into the underhang. Hmm. Okay, let's see what the next memory starts with. Macau. By day, a bustling port. By night, a hub for the Templars to trade those who oppose them into slavery. I have located the box, Xiao Jun. It's in the possession of Yu Deong, Another of Zhang Yong's tigers, the one they call the Slaver. So he is responsible for this cruelty. I shall pay him a visit. Tread lightly, sister. The Templars are searching all ships and cargo. They are looking for us now. I know you can kill these lesser men with ease, but I would suggest you remain invisible, a ghost, until you find your target. Lesser men. The Port, 1526, Macau. Xiao Jun begins the hunt for her next target, Yu De Yong. She will have to move through the Templar forces, searching the moored ships and patrolling the port side docks to reach the edges of the Tiger's Fortress. So, available upgrades, increased health, increased firecracker ammo. Okay, so you can get ammo. Uh, pouch upgrades, that's good. 
And secondary objective is kill the three Templar informants for 300 bonus points. Okay. Well, that was interesting. Um, showed some weaknesses there. I obviously need to improve on my combat skills. Um, but we'll see how we'll see how this seaside area goes. I love the background of this zone. Very cool looking. I like the hand drawn aspect of it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Thank <laughs> you.